Hoover Dam, rock and roll concert documentary mini documentary about the Hoover Dam. The Hoover Dam is a concrete arch gravity dam across the Colorado River, on the border between the U.S. states of Arizona and Nevada. It was built between 1931 and 1936 during the Great Depression and is one of the most iconic landmarks in the United States. The dam was built to control flooding, generate hydroelectric power, and provide irrigation water to the arid lands of the southwest. It is one of the largest dams in the world and still provides power and water to millions of people today. The Hoover Dam is also a popular tourist destination, and visitors can take tours of the dam, learn about its history, and enjoy the stunning views of the surrounding Black Canyon. The concert on the 8th of April, 2023, rock and roll legend Billy Idol performed the first ever concert at the Hoover Dam. The concert was filmed and will be released as a feature-length documentary later this year. Idol performed two sets at the concert, one at sunset with a full band and special guests, and one acoustic duo set on the roof of the powerhouse at the foot of the dam. The concert was a huge success, and Idol's performance was electrifying. He played all of his biggest hits, including Dancing With Myself Eyes Without a Face Rebel Yell and White Wedding. The concert was also a visually stunning event, with the Hoover Dam providing a breathtaking backdrop for Idol's performance. The documentary will capture the energy and excitement of the concert as well as the beauty of the Hoover Dam and the surrounding Black Canyon. The story the documentary will tell the story of the Hoover Dam and the Billy Idol concert, interwoven with interviews with Idol, other musicians who have performed at the dam, and historians and experts on the dam. The documentary will also explore the significance of the concert, both in terms of its historical value and its impact on the dam and the surrounding community. The character's Billy Idol is a rock and roll icon who has been selling out stadiums for decades. He is known for his rebellious attitude, his energetic live shows, and his timeless hits. Other musicians who have performed at the dam include Steve Jones, Sex Pistols, Tony Canal, No Doubt, and Alison Moss Hart, The Kills, The Dead Weather. Historians and experts on the dam will provide insights into the dam's history, construction, and significance. Local residents and business owners will share their perspectives on the concert and its impact on the community. The themes the documentary will explore the following themes, history. The Hoover Dam is one of the most iconic landmarks in the United States, and the documentary will explore its history and significance. Music. The concert was a celebration of rock and roll, and the documentary will explore the power of music to bring people together and create lasting memories. Community. The concert had a positive impact on the local community, and the documentary will explore the importance of community and the power of events like this to bring people together. Conclusion The Hoover Dam. Rock and Roll Concert Documentary will be a unique and unforgettable film that will entertain and inform viewers of all ages. It will tell the story of an iconic landmark, a legendary musician, and a historic event.